Hey everybody, it's me, Torre, and this time I am bringing you Razorfin Downs. Um, I put it on double speed here because of the length of time and there was so much to show that I had to uh, speed it up. Alright, uh, I'm bringing you Razorfin Downs because uh, I'm trying to do every instance one at a time, but I'm also backtracking to show other stuff too. I'm going to be doing, um, I still have to make a video of... Uh, with talent points and what they are and what are they for. Also, I'm going to do another video showing where you can get the stuff to make uh, videos. I've been asked to do that too. Um, a lot of times I get asked for what makes your portraits move. And I'm also going to show where to get that too. It is called the Adapt and it makes icons move. There's other ones, but I, I'm using Adapt. Um, as you see, I'm just doing my concentration, um, and I also have my Skull Flame Shield, which I am in love with, and uh, it is an awesome shield to have, especially it procs damage, and it also gives you some health back. So it's a really nice shield to have for pulling uh, these instances. Um, a lot of really good loot. I didn't notice how much loot there was in this instance. So I might spend a few times in here farming. Because a lot of the blues that do drop, you can disenchant for a Radiant Shard. Um, which is better than running um, Scarlet Monastery. Because uh, Scarlet Monastery, you get about one to two Radiant Shards. Um, this one was for the whole run. I got about five radiant shards, so it was pretty nice. Um, you see, I'm just finishing off the boss over here. There's a big gong. If you hit the gong once, you get a whole bunch of little spiders on the first one. Uh, they're very easy to kill. That's not a problem. And as you uh, beat them and you hit the gong again, uh, it does get larger. Um, these do go down pretty quick with, uh, with my concentration. Uh, I did switch to Retribution right now. I actually remembered to switch uh, so I can kill them a lot faster. There, I killed them. I hit the next gong. And it's bigger spiders that come out. Here they go. Slightly larger. And, of course, they have to be elites because it wouldn't make it fun that way. <laughs> so it's four larger spiders. They go down again once again real quick uh, if you're going with a group make sure you pull keep them on yourself um, the way I have my add-on is if any party members get aggro it turns bright red and I instantly know that they have aggro so I can pull them inst off of them uh, so I'll just finish these guys off and then you ring the, the gong again for the final boss, which I'll show you in a few seconds after I finish these last two, spamming concentration, mana up and tr get a f eat something before you start because uh, he he's pretty easy, but still you don't underestimate anybody. Um, so there you go, killing him. He's going down pretty quick. As you see, I'm, I'm spamming Concentration and Holy Shield. So every time he hits me, a block. And then Retribution, every time he hits me, he takes damage for every shot he hits me. And then I'll finish him off. Sometimes I like to... There, I just finished him off. Sometimes I like finishing him off with uh, Shield, just to get fancy. All right, here is another boss. He's at the top of the pillar. You see him dancing over there. Uh, he's kind of a pain to get to because he's at the top of the pillar, so... Um, he didn't, I didn't, usually I, I can, I can pull him down towards me, but today he didn't want to stay up. He just wanted to hang up there, so I finished off everything else that I pulled with him. The small skeletons died instantly. There's so many of them, but they die so quick. Because they're non-elites. Uh, they, they drop real quick. So what I did was I finished off, uh, the add-ons first. And, uh, same thing, concentration and block shields and uh and I just keep finishing them off um my once I I've been getting a lot of uh comments that my gear is not great yeah I know my gear is not great I've been just trying to level up to 70 and then I'm going to worry about gear because why why bother getting the good gear at level 70 you're going to get your final gear 
until the patch comes out. So why even bother switching, 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 switching until 70, you know. I'll just get the gear that I get from questing, and then when I hit 70, I'll start doing the dungeon stuff. It'll be so much faster and better for me. Save money, too. Um, so here I go, finishing off the, the boss, skeleton boss here. Finish him off real quick. And then, um, loot him up. I will put all the loots at the end of the video. There was five really good loots that I got. Disenchanted them for Radiance, but if you need them, they're really good, um, for you. Okay, so here I go. Speed it up again. Pulling, pulling, pulling. Uh, pulled, uh, one more pull. Uh, up to the, um... Mini boss. I, well, he's not mini boss. Well, Glutton. He's uh, not really a mini boss. Yeah, he's considered a mini boss because he does drop a blue. Uh, Glutton's cleaver, I believe it was. Over here, I just pulled until I had no health, and then I bubbled, healed up, and then I started spamming again my AOEs. This was a little bit tougher fight because I did pull a little too much, and stupid me decided to pull a little bit more before uh, anything. So I. Then I started AOing. Um, sometimes when you're doing these mass pulls, you always want to get that little, you want to get that next group that you see right in front of you. And sometimes that can be a very, very bad thing because uh, it can kill you. Like in this situation, um, I had nothing left. I had my bubble was used up, and uh, I had to use my lay of hands here. Uh, it was all totally my fault. I was being stupid. Um, I should have never went for that extra group. Um, but I used my lay of hands there. And you'll see me finishing off the last of them. Uh, Glutton is the last one to drop. Because of, he's a mini boss, so he has better health. Um, you can just see me spamming over and over again. I did use my, uh, my Tailsman, which uh, increases uh, damage 120 for 18 seconds I believe I gotta I always forget what it is and uh, there you go um, spamming 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 block watching that health uh, always carry a spare healing potion on you you never know bad thing the one thing I hate about healing potions is there's a level range of it can heal you from high to lower um, so you can get either healed full or you can get healed a, a little bit so um, that's the bad thing. But I always have that spare bubble that only lasts for 8 seconds if I'm in trouble. Um, that one is not that great, but 8 seconds is enough to pull off 2 heals. Alright, there I go. Finish off these last 2 or 3 there. And head towards the final boss, which mostly does frost spells on you. So you just got to try to kill it as fast as you can. Because the last thing you need is uh, the boss pounding on you. And you've frozen. There you go. I'm pounding on the boss. Uh, it's it's a demon, so I'm hitting it with all types of holy spells. Um, of course, I'm going to have to bubble here for safety, and then finish con then finish off the boss. I concentrate on the boss first because the boss will freeze you, and you really don't want to have that done while fighting all these guys. So kill the boss off. You don't have to worry about getting stuck with a frozen spell. And then you can finish off the rest uh, with your AOEs. They drop really fast. Boss does drop really good items. Um, really, there's a lot of good mail stuff here for um, for paladins and for hunters. Um, you can really get some really good equipment in here. Um, haven't come across any epics in here. I don't think there is any. But uh, this is a, it's one of my, it's pretty fun to, you can run. I could say it's one of my favorites now. I used to really hate it, but uh, it's pretty simple to run through. Uh, my favorite would be Shadowfang Keep, and then Scarlet Monastery, and then this. All right, I got the Robe of the Lich. I got the Clud and Cleaver. I got the Bone Finger. I got the Death May Sash. And the carpus of whatever. <laughs> There's uh, go to Armory, check me out, um, subscribe to my videos if you like them, 
and I hope everybody enjoyed the videos. I got more coming, and uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Later.